Everything was good, y'all. Quimax Quay single win. Jazz the Fed Dante, the broke Prince Charming, the unsuccessful BCD, the skinny fat red guy, the skinny king Lagerfeld, etc. etc. And the black SMG001. Today, we got SMO movie Brooklyn Guys Adult Game Night, bro. Hopefully, we can get a series out of this. And hopefully, they'll be playing Naked, Twister, and possibly seeing a titty. Who knows? Who knows? But we're gonna jump right into it right about now. You know? Okay, guys, you ready to play Greedy Granny? Granny? Yeah, dude, it's been forever since the last time we yeah. had a game night. And tonight's the <clears> perfect granny. night for it because it's raining outside. How do you even play this game? Well, you spin the spinner here, and whatever number it lands on, that's how many times you press this button, and you try to steal a treat from Granny. But if she wakes up and spits her teeth out, you lose. She looks dead. Oh, trust me, she's not dead. She's one greedy granny. All right, Cody, you go she first. Look okay. Deceased. Um, looks like I have to press it once. <sighs> okay. Your turn, Junior. Okay. How many times do I gotta press it? I've never uh, seen this time. game. Can you press it for me? Uh, okay. <sighs> okay, get your treat. Can you grab it for me? Why do I have to do everything? Because you're right there. Okay, your turn, Joseph. All right, my time is shot. Joseph about to lose, <sighs> bro. Ooh, two times? Uh, can you, you press it for me, dude? Uh, okay. <laughs> That's it. Reaction, Jeffy. Well, I'm missing a chromosome, so it takes my brain a second to process the signal. <laughs> Marvin, did you just hear Jeffy scream? I think so. Well, what yeah. if he's hurt? Go check on him. Bro, he's neurodivergent. He always gonna scream, bro. I could be sitting here doing. I could be sitting here doing an SML reaction video currently at eight o'clock p.m. and I could just hear. Aah! That's just Jeffy being Jeffy. Ain't nothing wrong with that boy. He's just a little slow. That's all. Jeffy, stop screaming, you goober! Marvin, yeah, go man. check on him. No. He's fine. Yeah, but Cody, you lost. Yeah, yeah, you lost, Cody. Wait, how did I lose? Because you pressed the button for Joseph. Mm -hmm. what, but it was Joseph's turn. But it was your finger that made her wake up. Yeah, no, it was Joseph. the pressure of your finger, dude. Yeah, no. if, if Joseph would have pressed it, it wouldn't have went off. But since you pressed it so hard, you wanted Joseph to lose. Well, yeah. It was gonna go off no matter who pressed it. You have a problem with Joseph? You pressed it hard so yeah. she would wake up. What? No, this is stupid. I don't want to play this game anymore. Why? Because you cheated to make Joseph lose. Cheater. What? You guys are cheating. Oh no. Oh, definitely. All right, listen, we'll just play a different turn. game. But Cody, no more cheating. Yeah, well, I'm not Cody. cheating. Come on, get it together. Oh, there's someone at the door. Oh, you'll get up to go there. check the door, but not on Jeffy? <sighs> Hello? Yes. Hey, buddy, we're here for the surprise. Lady, where are we? Oh, sh don't worry about that, Karen. You know what? You just stay right here while I finish getting your surprise ready. What's going on? No Shut surprise. up, let me come inside. Uh, Karen, you stay here. <laughs> so what's going on? Oh, I screwed up really bad, man. Today's my wife's birthday, but I totally forgot. But I told her that I didn't forget and that I had a big surprise plan for her. So what's the surprise? Well, see, that's the thing. I don't really have a big surprise. I lied. You lied? Yeah, so I thought we could just set up a birthday party here, and I could tell it was a big surprise party that I planned a long time ago. Hey, you want no. us to lie? Yes, oh, exactly. Yeah. A big convincing yeah. lie, yeah. But we don't have the stuff for a party here. Well, exactly. And that's why I brought two for $60 for your wife to go buy party supplies while we distract my wife. I don't want to lie! I'm gonna need Bitch, more please, money. just help me out here. It's not that hard. I'm gonna need okay? more money. It's not even a lie if we really do it. Well, what kind of party supplies? You know, like balloons and cupcakes, party shit. I don't know. Go! Nah, bro. If we bring in cupcakes, ADP is gonna magically appear. It's like it's like saying Bloody Mary in the mirror three times. If you bring in cupcakes and say cupcakes three times, ADP will be coming in, bro. And they're not doing it for no sixty dollars, bro. I gotta do it. I got at least a band. Give me a thousand dollars and some head, and I will more than happily do the surprise for you. This is your fault. You should have you should have had this prepared. You the you the husband, ain't it? You the one that's supposed to be having this setter. You can't be putting this on me. It's not my fault. You forgetful. Boy, what the heck, boy? Hey, just okay. no. Jesus, how do you even deal with her? Uh, how do we distract your wife? I don't know. Do you have anything fun? Well, the kids are playing board games downstairs. Yes, that's perfect. Okay, just ground all of them, and we'll take no, their no, board games do. and play them with my wife. Is board games enough to distract your wife? Oh, yeah, absolutely. Uh, my wife is an absolute dunce, okay? A complete nincompoop. Okay, so I'll go get the board games, and you go get your wife. Yes, I will go do that. What are we supposed to do, Cody? I think you're supposed to bend over in front of it and let it floss your butt crack. I'll pass. What are you kids doing? <laughs> We're playing board games. Well, Jeffy, you're grounded for screaming earlier. I was scared. Well, it hurt my ears, so grounded. Well, at least we can keep playing. No, all you kids, you better go upstairs or I'm going to tell your parents you were doing drugs. Ah, snitch. Well, what's your deal, dog? What the we're having an adult party downstairs and there's no kids allowed. Yeah, well, I'm going to the adult party. I'm 18. No, it's my house, so you got to listen to my rules, Jeffy. So all the kids upstairs. Gee. Now. Uh, yes, sir. Okay. Make it hey, twist. Karen. Bye. Well, it's gonna be worth it when you see a surprise. Come on! Hey, you ready? Yeah, I got a bunch of board games. Oh, that's perfect. Hey, I grabbed a beer out of your fridge. I hope you don't mind. Bonnie, where are we? 
Oh, you can take your blindfold off now, Karen. <gasps> Wait, what card is against this? Humanity is fire. Surprise! I love card against humanity. Surprise! It's a surprise what? party! Wait, you threw me a surprise party? I thought you forgot! No, no, I would never forget yeah, your please. birthday. But look, we're going to play board games before your party! Board games? I love board games! Yeah, I know, so just pick one. Uh, let's play this one! Where's the Twister? pot? Uh, it says it roasts your friends for you. Yeah, it's a great game, super fun. <gasps> you played it before? No, but we totally should. Yeah, let's do it. So how do we play this game, Boiny? Well, you draw a card, and whoever the card describes the best gets to keep the card. Oh, how fun! I want to go first. Who is most likely to talk through the whole movie? Definitely her. That'd be you, Karen. <laughs> I do Definitely not, can. Boiny. Yeah, you do. Take the card. Let's see what I got. Please. Let's see. Who has the shortest attention span? Karen. That's another card for you, Karen. That's not true. <gasps> this, oh, my God. This game I made love this that. wall color. Yeah, I'm just gonna give you this card. All right, my turn. All right, who comes the least prepared? That's you because you forgot her birthday. Shut yeah. the fuck up. Oh, it's yeah. my turn again. Let's see. I who needs a mute button? Yeah. That sounds like you again, Karen. Boyney, that's not very nice. That's yeah, true. well, it's true. You need to be quiet. It's absolutely true. All that. Like, golly, bro. Golly. I, like, I'm surprised. I'm surprised Brooklyn guy didn't Kurt Cobain himself already, bro. You got to deal with that all day and on. I'd, 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 I'd rather deal with Jeffy than deal with 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 with, with, with Karen. All I'm hearing in my later. All right, let's see who has the most annoying voice. Another card for you, Karen. Absolutely. Wow, you're good at this game. I don't like this game, Boyney. It's kind of mean. Oh, I love this game. All right, it's my turn again. Us. All right, let's see. Who never shuts the fuck up? Wow, Karen, another card for you. You should go yeah. pro. Okay, you know what? It's my turn again. I'm going. Who is most likely to get offended by a joke? Karen. Well, that one's for you, Boyne. I don't get offended. I don't get offended at anything. I love jokes. I like jokes all the time. I don't know what you're talking about. Well, I'm going to go again. Let's see. Who is most likely to get checked into anger management? Oh, that's <laughs> another one for you, Boyne. Nah, okay, that's I have anger problems, Karen. I just need to be away from you. Okay, let's see what we got. Gotta have Whose phone it. do you want to go through the most? Let me see your phone. Oh, you're never going anywhere near that damn thing. I want to see your phone. No, 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 no. Uh, who is most likely to start an argument for no reason? Why it sounds like you care because you're starting shit. No, I'm pointing. You started this whole argument. Oh, during the you're supposed to be chilling. They were with a fight. I got a card. I got a card. How about, how about this? Um, who would bitch out their grandma for not giving them enough birthday money? Me. Oh, yeah. That'd be me. Yeah, Gam Gam only gave me $5 for my 37th birthday. She knew I needed rent money. She's loaded. She can afford it. Only $5? Man. Bro, I wish my grandma would only give me five dollars, bro. If 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 it was my thirty second birthday that's coming up in a couple months, if it's my thirty if it's my thirty second birthday and my grandma she come up to me, give me a hug and give me a Hallmark card and four dollars, I'm slapping the dust off her, bro. I'm slapping the wrinkles off her, bro. I'm 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 slapping I'm slapping the wig off that that individual. Cause ain't no way you about to give me just five dollars for my thirty second birthday. You got to give me at least. At least a couple hundred. I'm a grown man. We not. I'm not a kid no more. I'm not a kid no more. So the fact that she would even feel feel the need to disrespect me with five, I'm slapping the hell out that bit. <clears throat> I'm slapping the heck out that woman. That's a fact. But Family Gam -Gam or not, is a stingy bitch. I hope you fucking die, Gam Gam. You know what? I don't want to play this game anymore. Thanks. It's making me pissed off about Game Game. Boyney, maybe you should stop drinking. Actually, I was just maybe thinking I need should. another one. Yeah, maybe she should be quiet. I'll get a different game. Ah, stupid Karen starting shit. Hey, you yelling at your wife on her birthday? Yeah, she started it. Well, what are you doing? I'm getting more drinking. beer. It's the only way I'm going to get through the rest of this party. Well, just try to calm down. You're being kind of crazy. Yeah, well, that's up to her. Okay, I'm back. Oh, okay. Boyney, you brought a beer for everyone? <laughs> Good joke, Karen. You should be a comedian. No, these are all for me. Well, yeah. I went ahead and picked out the next game. It's called Spin the Dare. And you spin the arrow, whoever it lands on picks up a card, and they have to do the dare. Okay, cool. Well, I'm going to spin to go first. Well, it doesn't matter who spins first, Karen. It, it doesn't even matter who spins as long as it's whoever it lands on. Boyney, it's my birthday. I'm spinning first. Holy oh, God. Boyney, it landed on you. You get to draw a card and do the dare. Okay, let's see here. Uh, let another player go through your camera roll for two minutes. That's not Absolutely, happening. Absolutely, yeah, that's not happening. <laughs> that's not happening. I got, I got too much naked. I got too many naked men on my camera roll. There's no like, not even my mom could go through my camera roll. I got way too many naked pictures of of age adult men 
to 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 have somebody in my camera. There's no way in hell I'm letting somebody in my phone. That's a fact, bro. If somebody seen my phone, bro, I promise I'll be going to jail. I promise. Oh, I'll go through your yes. phone, pointy. You're not going through my phone, Karen. What do you have to do with that? That's the deal. No. Well, how about this? How about we can all skip one dare, but only one? I'll remember that, pointy. Okay, so I have to do this dare. Let's see. Invite the last person you called who isn't already here to come join in on the fun. Oh, hell no. Who was the last person you called? It was Jonathan, but I only called him to tell him to stop calling me. Boiny, invite your brother over. Call yeah, him. That's not happening. Then let me go through your phone. I guess I'm calling Jonathan. <laughs> okay, it's ringing. Hey, Brooklyn guy. You want to block my number? Bro. Bro. Come on, bro. It's literally like, why are you beating your meat in the middle of the day, bro? I can understand if it was like 12, 1 a.m., you want to tap in with some fem boys on Spank Bank or, you know what I'm saying, or a shemail tube. Like, I could understand it, but, bro, in the middle of the day watching, I don't even want to know what he watching. I know it's something crazy. No, this is for is. a dare. That's the only reason I called you. I knew you didn't hate me. Oh, I do, but we're playing this game, and it dared me to call you and invite you to Karen's birthday party. <gasps> Karen's birthday party? I'm on my way. <sighs> Oh, that's him. Okay, Hello. Thanks. Where's Sharon? Because I heard there was a fire in my pants. <laughs> Is that my fireman outfit? Stop it. Stop. Stop stripping. I said stop it. Put your clothes oh, why? Back Doesn't Karen want a sexy stripper for her birthday? Yeah, maybe if it was a sexy one. Look, just go home, change into a normal outfit, wash my fireman outfit, because I'm assuming you're not wearing underwear. Nope. Okay, yeah, wash that, and then come back, and I'll let you in. Oh, okay. Thank you. Okay. Okay, he's here, so I win the deal. So, where's your birthday girl? I'm right here! Mm -hmm. Catch it! Oh, I caught it! But why'd you catch it, Karen? I don't know, Boiny. So, have you gotten your birthday spanking yet? Cause I'm gonna give you 18! Cause there's no way you're a deal for 18! Aw, Boiny, oh. did you hear that? He thinks I'm young! Yeah. Nah, he... No way, yo! Nah, tell me, there ain't no way that she's a day over 18. Hey, yo, yo, ma, somebody ban Jonathan. Somebody ban Jonathan. Yeah. Wait, yeah. I didn't miss the part where Karen gets in her birthday suit, did I? Okay, Jonathan, just calm what down and let's play this game, okay? It's called Spin the Dare, okay? So you, so you just draw a card and you do the dare that's on the card and it's your turn. But, boy, you got to spin it. Yeah, we're not doing that anymore. It's Jonathan's turn. Now pick a card, Jonathan. Oh, okay. Ooh, this one's spicy. Reveal who you F, marry, and kill using people from the group. Well, I killed Yuki guy. Thanks. And then I would marry Karen. Aww. And then I would F Karen <laughs> over and over and over and over and over. Bro, and okay, Jonathan, Jonathan, Jonathan. Okay, stop, stop. Okay, uh, we can all skip a dare, and you're skipping that dare, okay? Pick a different dare. Bro, oh, okay. So funny. Oh, this one's juicy. Take a selfie, kissing the person to your left on the lips and post it on social media. Pucker up, baby. Oh, okay, okay. I don't want to play this game anymore. We're still, we're going to stop playing. No, that's not fair. You can't do that. <laughs> Bro, sound like he about to shoot up the party. <laughs> Bro, sound like he about to shoot up the whole house. No, you can't do that. Holy moly. Somebody, yo, somebody has to keep a good eye on Jonathan, bro. If he don't get no coochie soon, somebody gonna be dead in the next couple of minutes, bro. Please, bro. Please, somebody keep that eye on, on, on Jonathan. It's not part of the rules, it's Karen's birthday! We're not back. doing that, Jonathan. Let's play that Twister instead. Oh, hell yeah. Twister can do. No, no, Twister the game. Oh, yeah. It's gonna be a game. Okay, let, let's start the game. Yeah. So what are the rules for Twister? Well, clothes? you spin this spinner, and then whatever body part and color it lands on, you put that body part on that color. But, Boiny, we don't have feet, so what happens if it spins on left foot or right foot? Ooh, I know. I'm going to fix your board. We'll be right back. All right, so I fixed your board. So now it says Karen's butt or Karen's boobs. We're not playing this. Bro, it's Go ahead so and spin, down. Karen. Yeah. Oh, okay. But, 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 green! Rose says the party's ready. Oh, thank God. Okay, it's time to put the blindfold back on. Ooh, great idea, looking guy. That way she doesn't see where she's sitting. No, no, it's for the party. Come on, Karen. And and the crazy thing, like, out of all women, bro, all the all women to sent for, you're simping over Karen. Like, I can understand 
I can understand if you're simping over a, a beautiful specimen like Malu Travail. Like, like, like I could, like I could understand that. Like, if if Malu, if Malu told me to delete my channel just to just for me to smell the last seat that she sat in, I would a hundred percent with no hesitation delete my channel. That's something. That's I need that. I require that. But if you simping over somebody like Karen, you have to get your head checked, brother. You're something that's you're you're mentally ill, bro. You're mentally sick. You are. You are. Trust me. Okay, the party's ready. Wow, this party actually doesn't look too bad. I did a good job. Boiny, I can't see where I'm going. Ooh, I'll help you just back up over here. Oh! Jonathan, stop spanking my wife. Well, she needs her birthday spanking anyway. 17 more. Karen, you can take the blindfold off. Oh, okay. Oh! Stop it, Jonathan. 16 more. <gasps> Boiny, you set this up just for me. Where's EDP? Uh, yeah, yeah, I sure did. I, I set all this up months ago. Cupcakes are stale as fuck. Boiny, all those mean jokes you were making were just to distract me from you setting up a surprise birthday party? Nah. Yep, that. All of the things you just said, all of that is right, yeah. No. Yeah, so we should light these candles. Ooh, Karen, I bet if you just touch the candles, they'll set on fire. Cause you're hot. Oh, damn it, Jonathan, stop spanking her! I'm gonna go get the lighter. Okay, lit the candles. Let's sing a happy birthday. Yeah. Happy birthday to you. Ow! Happy birthday to you. Ow! Yeah. Happy birthday. Like I could like like Jonathan the type of guy, like if you were to John, if Jonathan was ever to get arrested, he would get arrested off of sexual assault, bro. He would be the type to be on the sex sex offender list. Like I could just like he just has the sex offender look, bro. He looked like the type to be diddling kids. He he looked like the type to be with some kids, bro. So I feel like we have to keep our good eye on this brother. Not your glass, your glass eye. You gotta keep your, your good eye on this brother. Cause you look around, you look away for one second, he already gonna be jumping in somebody's pants unconsensually. <laughs> like, bro. Birthday to Karen. What the heck? Happy birthday to you. Bro's a sexual harasser. Oh, Jonathan, that was beautiful. No, bro, like, you <laughs> Jonathan wrong. Come here, Boiny. Give me spooches. Oh, you taste like beer, Boiny. I know. I love you, Boiny. Thank you so much for my party. It's the best birthday ever. Yeah, I love you too, Karen. Mm. Should have got her a muzzle for a present. Whoa, pause, pause. Hey, yo. Why was he sucking it like a di uh, uh, penis? But anyway, that's SML movie. Brooklyn guys, adult game night, brother. I don't think Karen deserved the birthday party, bro. Cause I, I, I already don't like her. Like I know Brooklyn guy can't stand her. I know for a gosh darn fact I can't stand this bit, this woman. So she wouldn't have got nothing for me. In the famous words of Fifty Cent, I don't know what you heard about me, but a bitch can't get a dollar out of me. Facts. Maybe Fifty Cents. And then Jonathan. Jonathan simping over Karen. Like I said, I could understand if it was an ash cash. You know what I'm saying? A goth egg. You know what I'm saying? Fine ass, sexy ass, delicious ass, gorgeous ass, Malu Travail. I could understand it. I could understand if a, if a brother simped. But you're simping over Karen? Brother, you are down bad to the umpteenth degree. And you need medical attention. Okay. But I hope you guys enjoy, man. Uh, if you do have a wonderful lady slash wonderful man in your life, make sure you treat him with nothing but the utmost love and respect. Because if you if you don't treat him with, with love and kindness, Big Quaymax will be snatching him up, man or woman. All right. Hope you have a good day. I'm going to catch you all next year.